Hi everyone, it's Arthur Abel and I am back with another video. So I'm going to collect my uh, daily Ethereum mining from Octoin and I think I will have enough to do another um, upgrade on a new Ethereum contract. And then I'm gonna update you on how I track that. So let's scroll down here. As you can see, I am under my mining tab and um, we have been uh, paid for the mining for uh, today, January 5th. Um, so these are the current contracts that I have for the Ethereum mining. And what I'm going to do is come over and collect my uh, daily Ethereum payments. And when you withdraw, it goes over into your wallet that we're getting ready to take a look at. Let's see, okay, so let's see how much Ethereum that is. Okay, yeah, I thought I had more. So we just just seeing it change. It uh, it now reflects the amounts that I just uh added um from my daily mining. So that was cool. I've never been inside the wallet and see it change like that. Okay, so let's try that again. Let's see. So Ethereum is really really close to a thousand again. I was waiting to see if Bitcoin was going to uh hit seventeen thousand today. It's it, it's had a little dip since uh, this morning. Um, so anyway, let's let's see how much Ethereum that is. Uh, 996. Okay, so about 68 bucks, nice. So that's definitely enough to uh, do a upgrade over here. So let's switch. Um, anytime you want to do mining, um, you have to do two things. You have to tell um, Octoin what currency you want to use and what you want to mine. So um, right now I'm just mining Ethereum. I may do Zcash at some point. I don't know. But right now I'm just going to do Ethereum. And right now it always defaults on using OCC coins. Um, so because I'm buying more Ethereum contracts with the Ethereum that I'm making, I'm going to switch it over to Ethereum. And how much did I have? 0 0.06. Let's see. All right, so I can buy two. I can buy two. Okay. Um, I'm going to buy two, and I am going to keep it at the 30 day mark. Now, once you hit start mining, it automatically um, deducts out of the wallet that you that you shows up here. So it, that's it's pretty cool. It's a really seamless system. Um, I'm loving how easy and profitable um, Octoin is turning out to be. So I, I chose my two contracts. I'm going to go ahead and hit start mining. Um, and you'll notice it will pop up down here. So let's do that. Oh no, <laughs> sorry, the mining power powers are fully rented by users. Please check, check the availability of mining late, later. So, so guys, you're, wa you're watching this live as I'm doing this. So while it sucks that Octoin has run, run out of power um, uh, you know, um, to mine Ethereum, this, this goes to show you that um, Octoin uh, is a real company doing real mining. Um, you know, so I'm glad that I decided to uh, record uh, me doing this upgrade. So I guess I won't be doing an upgrade right now. Um, but the cool thing is, is that if I wanted to, I could trade Ethereum instead of mine for it. So let's let's do it. Okay, Octoin, let's click invest. And a trading uh, contract. Let's see what happens. As you see, it switched me over to trading. Okay, so um, 
so again, how much Ethereum did I have this? Okay, so what I can could do is take my Ethereum that I have here and start a trading contract with it. So watch this. Hit Ethereum. I paste in the exact Ethereum that I have. It's projecting that if I go with a 30-day term, I will uh, make 23% if the accruals, which is the interest rates, um, stay the same for the next 30 days. Um, again, this is showing you the past 30 days. So this is just a projection to give you an idea on what you can expect. So let's go ahead and trade with it. So that's this is the beauty of Octoin, guys. They ran out of mining power, and I'm going to trade with it. I'm just I'm just blown away right now. Sorry. <laughs> um, all right, so let's uh, stick with the 30 days. Um, and as you can see, again, that should be all my yeah, Ethereum that I have. Perfect, perfect. Okay, so let's do that. And I'm going to invest. 30 days, yep. Cool. cool. So that's done. And as you see, uh, this trading contract will start in about four hours. Um, cool. That was awesome. Um, so what I want to do is update you on how I'm going to start uh, tracking this because I think I think yesterday is when I talked about the alt pocket that IO tracker that I was using, and um, and I like them because they allow me to uh, document all my mined assets. Um, since my last video, I figured out that um, because these are mined assets, um, you can document you know when you receive them, but it's not tracking you know a price based on the date that you put it in the system is really just tracking it live. So um, it's really no reason for me to have separate, you know, mining um, transactions listed here for the same currency. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to combine um, my uh, crypto assets under um, each other. So I'll just have one Ethereum listed here, one Bitcoin, so on and so forth, and just keep updating it you know, as I get mine coins and um, as I update it, it will uh, reflect here. So let me do that now. Um, so what I'm going to do is combine these two and I'm going to show you how I do that. Um, but first, let me come to my calculator so I can grab the exact amount of Ethereum that I have listed there. Right. Okay. Um, so as you can see, okay, let me copy this before I make a mistake. So as you can see, it's currently um, 83 and 54. So what I want to do is now I've only done this once since yesterday. So I'm trying to figure out how I, how I do it. Oh, that's right. Come up here. Hit add new mining. Um, I'm going to put in that amount from the calculator. And I'm going to put the day's date because every day, I guess I'll change it since it doesn't matter. Um, date. Add coin. So I just want to double check make sure I, I did that right. Uh, Yep, that's right. Okay, so, um, so it should match these amounts, right? Let's see. So, sorry, guys. This I'm I'm new to uh, using altpocket.io, so, um, and probably most people who are watching this probably would be new to it as well. So, let's see how I'm navigating this. Okay, perfect. It matches. So, what I did was make sure that these amounts equal equal. Uh, this amount. So yeah, because it doesn't matter since these are mined assets, it doesn't matter that it doesn't, you know, reflect the current price. I mean the the price that you bought bought it at or, or received them. So so yeah, so this is gonna work. So I just go ahead and delete these two.
and let's delete this one. <clears throat> so once that is done, perfect. So once that is done, I will just have it uh, much more streamlined. So I will have my, my Bitcoin here, uh, all my mind Bitcoin here, and all my mind um, Ethereum here. So cool. I'm liking this. And this is where I will, uh, oh, I will update my OCC coin. So I also said in my previous video that because OCC are not, the OCC coins are not on external platforms uh, yet, um, uh, this website won't be able to find it. So right now I'm just going to use Tether. Um, and... Uh, I last night I got me some more OCC coins. Um, so let me copy this amount, add it to my tracker. So I need to let's clear this. So I need to take this plus. That amount equals, let's copy that. Update mm. that and investment. Okay, I did something wrong. Let's try that again. It didn't give me this problem. Uh, price paper coin. On the other day. Let's see if that, that works. Okay. Okay. Cool. So um, my tether is listed under the active investments. Um, so as you can see, I put in uh, 730 uh, USDT to tethers, but is actually, you know, OCC coins again. So so cool, I updated that. And as you can see, now I have an investment amount listed. Um, so my OCC coins are worth right now 730 because I have 730 OCC coins, which are worth $1 each. Um, and um, it has net worth profit, active profit. Um, I don't know what the active profit is. Um, oh, is the uh, price increase on this. So that's kind of a little bit deceiving because these are not OCC coins, but doing my best for now until the OCC coins are on, on the exchanges. Um, I think that's all I have for you for this video. Let's refresh real quick to see if Bitcoin made any movements. Nope, about the same. Okay. All right, guys, I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.